Hey everybody, J&A Review, and today we're at Triple H RV here in Haleyville, Alabama. Now, if you just found our channel, go ahead and subscribe, follow along with us, and give us a thumbs up. Today, we're gonna to be looking at a 2023 Palomino Puma, model number 26 RBSS. So let's get started. The length on this Puma is 29 feet, 10 inches. The dry weight is 6,033 pounds, and the hitch weight is 610. Yes, so I mean, if you guys are looking for a couple's coach, this would be a great one to look at. Right up here, you see you're gonna have some pass-through storage. And let's go around and show you the other side. here on the other side of your storage nice area here plenty of room you are going to have power stabilizers on this one your power awning it's got an LED light strip uh, 21 mm -hmm. foot awning let's go right on down the side here it's got a little outside kitchen area with a mini fridge yeah and a gray stone griddle yeah that is cool. And this actually is going to give you two quick connects. There's going to be one right down here. And you actually have another one back here at the back. Um, once again, we're a little bit close, but here's the campsite view. So let's go in and take a look. quick look around here this is a rear bath model so we'll just go ahead and start at the very back okay now this may be for one of those for the people that maybe don't like a uh you know walk through bath yes um nice size shower now jeremy is six feet tall so hey that skylight is perfectly placed yeah. so yeah plenty of room nice shower doors in here mm -hmm. Give you an exhaust fan. You've got a hook there for your towels. Your tissue holder is already in place. Plenty of room around your foot flush toilet. Nice linen storage over there. And it goes all the way down. Yeah. Your sink here, you do have a medicine cabinet. Okay. And a little bit of storage below that. This is gonna have your heating vent in the floor. And they give you these cool little night lights. I love those. Uh, the little night lights. Those are neat. And power so you can dry your hair. Sorry, I just <laughs> squirrel. All right, right next to your door is your pantry area. It also has a hanging rod in it so it can double um, as a storage closet nice area plenty of room that you can actually put your garbage can in here moving on into the living area here in your slide you're going to have your theater seating nice cup holders storage here it has power parachute parachute i want to call it power chute i don't know why oh my goodness storage up above it oh yeah yeah no problem nice reclining pull down shades. Now you cross from your theater seating, your TV is going to mount right up there. So your mounts already in place, your cable connections, your electrical connections. Uh, what is that? HDMI cable is already there. And you've got a sound bar. You have electric fireplace for those cooler mornings and a little spot down there. You can kick your shoes off or, um, you might could slide a dog dish in there if you need to. These are comfortable too. They are comfortable. Mm. Uh, and also in here, your heating is going to be in the floor. Uh, let me go ahead and finish out your slide here with your dinette. Storage below that on both sides. And of course, this will yeah. drop down for some additional... Yeah, you can access yeah. it from that side too. So you can have additional sleeping here if you have some kids with you. And there is a plug-in up under the table yes, that was just noticed. There sure is, right back there. In case you need to sit there with your computer or something. Right. 
All right. All right, let's move on into the kitchen area. You're gonna have a 12 volt compressor fridge. Your fuses are gonna be located right below it. A graystone microwave in this microwave. one. With Earth your range. Yes. And down here you got a three burner cooktop with an oven. And I'm not sure if this shows up on on the camera, but you've got some accent lighting oh, yeah. around the edge that there. Cool. That's really neat. Nice cabinets up above your sink. One on one over here. Yes, and that is open all the way back to the corner back there. Actually, this is some pretty good counter space in here. We've got a plug in right here. Some storage down below with drawers. Oh, and there's another plug in over there. I, didn't, I missed that one. So, yeah, plenty of places to plug in your coffee pot or crock pot, Instapot. Okay. Yeah, all those, all those kind of things. The little hooks there. Oh, those are new. They haven't had these. So you can hang your leash up there or your key rings. Okay, I got sidetracked. Let's move on in here to the main bedroom. You're going to have some hanging storage on both sides of the bed. Some storage right up above. A couple of lights on your headboard. This is going to be a queen-size bed. Mm -hmm. Nightstands. Um, there's power here. This side's going to have power and USB, and I'm pretty sure there's storage underneath. Yep. Yes, and your spare cover is under there. This one is going to be prepped for a second air, so if you want to add um, another AC unit, just get with your dealer. Your TV is going to be right over here yep. in the corner. Your cable connections and power is already in place. All right. And also in here, you have a floor vent. So, another quick look around at this Puma. All right, everybody. If you like this Palomino Puma travel trailer, dealership's information, it'd be down in the description along with their uh, telephone number, website, so you can maybe look up the pricing of this unit. And if you just found our channel, go ahead and subscribe, follow along with us, and give us a thumbs up, and follow us on Facebook. Thanks, everybody.